The cost of living and eating on Michigan State's campus could soon be going up. It's our top story at six. Thank you for joining us. I'm Siobhan Klepfer. And I'm Sherry Jones. Tomorrow, the MSU Board of Trustees will decide whether or not to approve an increase in housing and dining rates. McCoy Scribner is here for you tonight and shares what current students have to say about the proposal. McCoy? Sherry and Siobhan, while this potential residence hall rate won't affect second year students, MSU says the increase will help the school keep up with inflation. But students I spoke with say they aren't sure they can keep up with the costs of college. I think it's already way too expensive. Like it seems like a lot for an incoming freshman to take on. That's so crazy, and I feel really bad for the incoming first year students. Show up. One side. Show up. All similar feelings from students on campus after catching wind of the proposal by MSU officials. One spokesperson who did not go on camera confirms the nearly 7% increase and says a majority of it is to help with inflation where the rest would go to residence hall renovation projects. One student says while upgrades might be needed, a rate hike this high isn't the way to go. Personally, I already like had like trouble enough getting in here. I don't see that it's like totally needed. Maybe like a less increase. According to another student, first year Spartans already have enough costs to worry about. Adding that an $800 increase might even deter future students from enrolling. I think that's kind of unnecessary. I feel like a lot of students pay for their own schooling and room and board, and I feel like that's kind of um, just like unattainable for some students. Hearing from like my other friends and like from myself, like it's very expensive, and I feel like it shouldn't be that expensive already. Another Spartan adds that if the school does decide to pass the increase, they should in turn offer up more reimbursements to students to help keep other costs down. If you're going to do pass this bump, think about lending more aid. Think about more giving out more scholarships with more scholarships with more money available to them to be able to afford this because not everyone is as fortunate and can afford everything. Efforts will be taken up tomorrow by the board of trustees for a vote at 9 a.m. and the Hannah Administration Building. We'll of course have the latest for you on air, online, and through our Six News app. Back to you. All right, thank you, McCoy.